They did. It hasn't been. It hasn't been a few people. They, there was a girl uh, at one point named, uh, I think her name was Tila Tequila. She kind of was, she kind of got to see as far as I seen in the industry. And then she started telling and then she disappeared and went away. I don't, I don't know what happened with her. Um, but there, there has not been an artist that I know personally, that I know that know me, that know that what I'm saying is the truth, that watch me and know that what I'm saying is the truth, that will say, yo, what Choke is saying is real, right? Because they are, they are part of it, so they can't speak out against it. But I'm telling you, it's going to be at a point, and I'm praying for that day. Not that only to, for all these people to be outed, but just so that the world can understand that there is a time period that has been going on for shit. I want to probably say since Sammy Davis Jr., right? You ever heard the story when Eddie Murphy uh, told Sammy Davis Jr. that he, you know, he worshipped the, uh, Satan and Satan was more powerful than God and black, all this other shit. And, and Eddie Murphy was like, what the fuck? Like, but that that that's kind of uh somebody telling it, but who the fuck is gonna believe it, right? Unless you got a third eye and you you can think of above what you can see, right? Why would Eddie Murphy be telling? I think he told Jerry Seinfeld, was it Seinfeld? I think it was Seinfeld. It was Eddie Murphy and Seinfeld. And they was riding in the car. He told them this story about when he met Sammy Davis Jr. And Sammy Davis Jr. was telling him about uh, Lucifer and how powerful Lucifer was, this, that, and the dirt. But like I said, from Sammy Davis Jr. and the Rat Pack all the way up into now, all the way through hip hop. There's this cold underground. It ain't even underground no more. Because if you know, it's blatant, it's blatantly right in your face, right? But if, if you, if you, Even if you have an inkling, if you, if you get like, it, it's blatantly, it, it's right in your face, right? But I swear to you, if, if you are the person that can't see, uh, it, like, all right, let's use. Jada Pinkett and Will Smith as, as an example, right? If you can't see what other people see in the rumors about Jada and Will and their sexuality, even though uh, they both publicly deny it, then it ain't no reaching you, right? Because where there's smoke is fire, right? And if if you got all these people saying these things, right? Now, I might know more than the 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 average viewer because I may know I may know somebody that may have relations had uh intimacy relations with these people right so i uh i, I wouldn't i'm gonna say may because i don't want to put no white business out there but i know that the people uh 
I know that I wasn't lied to, right? I I I I I value a person's uh word and know that I I wouldn't be lied to, right? But it still don't mean that I was in the bedroom and I seen it or this, that, and the third, right? But if somebody that is a credible source to me tell me that something is true and then I hear these rumors and it's a, it goes right along the lines with what I was told, then I'm not going to doubt it, right? Because why would this person make this up before I even hear it, right? Before it was even a rumor, I already heard it, right? So, but for the people that ain't in Hollywood or the people that ain't in the industry, you 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 want to hear this and you're going to see this and you're going to see them go and say, this is preposterous. I'm suing, <laughs> right? Because the person that uh, is a legendist may have not been in the bedroom with them. Now, if, if, if a person that has been in the bedroom with them came out and said it and then you seen the video or you had enough proof like cnn uh, with the cassie video then you go to get all these other people oh yeah 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 they believe it right but it's like uh the room is about diddy all the years right all the, all these years you uh you take that take that and you know it's about him but a lot of people still because of all the kids and shit all the girlfriends you know they wouldn't think that uh he was he was bisexual right allegedly right but now with the credibility of the Cassie video and the Cassie lawsuit and Cassie seeing, saying that, um, you know, he was hiring men and, and whatever, whatever. And then you got the, the little rods and everything. Now, those people that you could never convince about Diddy, now they believe it. Now they, it, it, they believe it so much that it, it became no Diddy. Right? It became no Diddy because people believe it. Now, before this, there were still people that had doubt. And I, if once this indictment, man, let me tell you something, man. There are so many people that are shaking in their boots about this Diddy situation. I, I'm gonna name a few, and you could make your assessment to why they, they would be nervous. Jay-Z is definitely one. As much as y'all wanna say, oh, he got the baddest chick in the game, the nigga got a GLAAD award. And if you tell me he got a glad word because his mother, you's about the stupidest mother ever watching right now. Okay? He, he's one. If you think as many times as Beyonce caught this nigga cheating, that it, him and Diddy ain't freaking off. And the way that uh, these industry relationships work, a lot of these niggas' wives got girlfriends. Excuse me. A lot of these wives' husbands got boyfriends, right? Let me give you a, 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 a great example. I 
Oh God, I don't really want to say no names, but I'm, I, I have to in this case. This is public record, right? Dwayne Martin, right? Married to Tisha Campbell. Gina from Martin and Dwayne Ma uh, Martin from um, All of Us, right? Who is also Will Smith's best friend and business partner and rumored lover, right? Dwayne Martin is married to was married, I, 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 they may be divorced now. I think they divorced now. Uh, with Tisha Campbell for, I don't even know how long their marriage has been going on, right? He probably been married to uh, just as long as Will been married to Jada. Lisa Ray marries Michael Missick, the dude from Turks and Caicos. And Allegedly, Dwayne Martin runs off with Lisa Ray's husband, right? Now, this is all public record. I ain't dropping no tea or nothing. This is this is all public record. You can look it up, right? So my point is this. Thank you for the money, dummy. <laughs> right? Um, that's when you know I'm telling the truth. Um, oh, so... Like I said, this is something you could look up. This is something that uh, Lisa Ray has said publicly, right? But the point of, of the matter is this, right? How long do you think Tisha Campbell been married to this dude? And how long have you think she known about, uh, have known about this? This is her husband. So if, if, if Lisa Ray is saying, yo, your husband ran off with my husband, right? You think she just found out about his lifestyle? Or could she have just been cool with it and she might be doing what she doing? You think that they was married all these years? And even after that, after those allegations, they still were still married. So some of these relationships in Hollywood is because a lot of these people succumb to whatever casting couch or whatever job position or whatever interview audition or they made it and then they got offered more to 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 do some strange things for some change so all these people once they cross that line they all start getting together because they all did the same shit. so a lot of the relationships that you're looking at you may three be thinking it's one way and it's not, and it's an, it's another, and only until now, like I said, only until now, I I, I believe it may come out into this in this puffy case, right? But only until now, I think that people are starting to really see that there there is truth behind that, right? 
Like, 